Welcome to the Automation Car Design Competition. Over 450 entries, 11 categories and Mr. Regular as a guest judge in his very own special category. The entries will be judged in two rounds, the preliminaries and the finals for each category. The categories span from way back 40s luxury barges all the way to futuristic concept cars. The preliminaries are judged on a scale from 0 to 10 by three judges. At least three finalists will be selected based on this score at the end of each category's preliminary round. Today we shall find out who's going into the finals of the 90s Hot Hatch Fun category. First up, Alex Rondeau. Oh, that's not a good start. That's not a good start. Um, yeah, just scoring some somewhat in the 80s there for for some categories and in fun, only 32. Um, engine quite a bit too powerful for the segment. Not not too much though. Well, it's fine. It's fine. Engineering time too long. Yeah, that's probably a minus one. The design. Let's oh. take a look. Ah, oh, okay. That's not half bad. Yeah, no. It looks cool. Yeah, and it's um, one of the, the, the wing is spot. What the hell? The wing. <laughs> the is wing a bit... is a little excessive, maybe, for a fun car. Um, this is this is more uh, like aftermarket shit, isn't it? A bit. Yeah, I'm thinking that about the Impreza wing, but uh, it would fit yeah. more on an RX-8, but not on this car. Okay, I so like what? it. The the yeah. front has a bit something Subaru-esque, so it's... Mm. But it's not bad at all. Yeah. yeah. I would say it's a good design, minus one. Yeah. Okay, Agreed. I was more for a solid design, minus one, but it's fine. Okay, yeah. five. Five of all. Alpino BR. Yeah, this is a lot better scoring. Uh, 119 in fun. Reasonable affordability, reasonable engineering time, a more reasonable engine, although also for the fun segment, a little towards the high end there, but um, good overall. So, design. Ah. Okay, oh, I like uh, it. Yeah. yeah, I do like it too. Especially like the, the lower front is nicely crafted with the um, inlay of the, the lights there into the vents. Yeah. Sides look all also right like the rear. The, the wing, the wing is not over the top like the other one. It's perfectly. Yeah, it's reasonable. Nice. Yeah. There's something strange, but I, I think it's a rendering. But could be. Also like the sides, Turbo Sport. Okay. Mm -hmm. What do you think of all? I would say it's I a good design. Could be a six. Yeah. Little six. With the stats of six, yes, I agree. Next up, Angry Kitten. Okay, let's take a look here. Well, fun is the appropriate target. A little low overall. The stats aren't quite there. 190 horsepower engine. All right, engineering time. What is uh, the design telling us? Um, um, it's 1989 not... called. Yeah, maybe. Yes. They want their design back. <laughs> exactly. They, they lost something and finally found it. That this mm -hmm. no, this is definitely not 1999. That's completely off, isn't no. it? Yeah. yeah. And the front mm -hmm. looks like a golf. It does. If it if it's like dated on 1990 or 1991, I can accept. Probably could accept it, but barely accept it. Nope. Um. So it it's not not terrible for what it tries to do but it's just off so how much is the design itself without the year mm, is it a five probably, or? A, probably a five it's a yeah. solid design okay so minus one or minus two mm. the stats are all right well considered a minus one minus one, one. Mm, so four of all yep archer 23 Decent stats, overall uh, a good distribution. 123 horsepower, good engineering time. What about the looks? Apart from it being very orange. I like it orange. Uh, mm, there's a little bit of dissonance between 
the shape of the body and the fixture used. Yeah. The, uh, the, especially the, the rear. The fixture, the, the body suggests like square or roundish, like mm. not not those shapes. Yeah, that's the, the body definitely like looks more like something from the eighties. Yes. Yes, that's true. Yeah. Okay, so what do you think of all? It's a meh design. Well, no, not, not that it's not fit. Mm. The fixtures don't fit to the, the whole body. Yeah, that is a bit of care. Yeah, uh, like I don't a, know. Probably I would give it a. Let me check again how much the market were. I probably give it a five, solid five. Okay. BMW M8. Well, this isn't a car that scores well. It just takes it 50 years to engineer, almost 50 years. Um, 49 point something. Uh, anyway, so this is utter garbage. It doesn't score anywhere. Yeah, completely, yeah, completely, completely off the mark. But what about the design? Mm. Well, it looks like a hatch. Uh, it's a. It is a hat. Hatch. Nothing else. But it's also weird looking. Yeah, mm. it's not too terrible, I would say. It, ha it has a distinct look from the front, at least. From the rear, it doesn't fit with the front, to me. But the um, front is a beluga kind <laughs> of thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah it is. Um, the but front anyway, does overall, look a bit mentally challenged too. I, I would overall, say, I would say it's a meh minus one or even minus two because yeah, it's so much yeah. mark. I mean, I'm, yeah, I think it's poor, maybe very bad. Yes. Yeah. So poor. At a least. Three? Yeah. No, the two. Oh, two. two. Okay. I want to be. Mm -hmm. a, I'll All go right. harsh on this. I'll be yeah. 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 That's that's right. The two. Boost and ethanol. Oh shit, boys! Someone figured out how to build a fun car. 185 competitiveness, extremely high drivability and sportiness. Um, a little ridiculous comfort rating, but um, a, a good engine. Very decent engineering mm. time. This is all looking great. And look at the mm. demographics. They are all green. This is a good one. Okay. So that's a definite plus one, independent of where it is on the scale. And what do we think about the design? Oh shit! Nissan wow. is a hot hatch. Nissan. <laughs> a little angry car. It's a Nissan Sky Hatch. <laughs> oh, okay. The front reminds me of the Damio. To me, the front reminds me of uh, Skyline. Yeah, the R33. The, the thing that really... Uh, let me check if I... Yeah, the rear wheels are thinner than the front one. Ah, okay. as well. Th that's a way to do. Yeah, well, that kind gives of. you a little bit more oversteeriness. Uh, oversteeriness. Yes. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's some care put ah. into this. Um, I don't quite ah. like the rear as much as the front. The rear has some style to it, but looks a bit too modern already. But it could work. Could yeah. work. It, mm. I, I like it. Yeah, <laughs> but overall? Yeah. I, th I, I think, think it's... That included, it's, it's, it's a 7 almost. Yes, I could give it a 7. Yeah, the I agree. The front I like. I agree. It's a, a little too ridiculous on the tires. I mean, this is this is mm. quite... Uh, yeah, that's not the appropriate look for something like this. But that set aside, it's still a very good 7, I would say, overall with those stats. Mm. Yeah. Amazing. Okay, 7. Bruno Pelosia. And this car definitely is aiming high in the towards the premium side of the fun demographic. It's not scoring all that well, but yeah, decent engine in there. Not too long engineering time. What about the design? Oh, That's very different. asymmetric in the front. Wow, not a yeah, bad thing though. It is. It, it fits. It, is. it has some nice look to it. It, it is a little daring. I have to give it that. The sides Probably. Are all but this overall doesn't give me a fun vibe, this car. Exactly. Yeah. It feels like it could be a normal sedan. Mm. Maybe the sport version of a normal sedan, but... Yep. Yeah, but nothing more. not a sports car, not a fun car, not... Nothing. Just I, I would say this is a clear meh. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Uh, maybe Although, a five... Uh, Probably, the, if the stats were better, I would give it a 5, so it's yeah, okay, I can give it a 4, okay. Cars kick. 
And another one that is aiming pretty high and quite failing to do so. The stats don't back it up. Uh, too long engineering time as well. Way too powerful engine for this category. Okay, what about the design? Hmm. Okay. I'm starting to thinking that making making 90s cars is easier than all the others. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Because so many people have a connection to them in real life. Mm -hmm. The 50s are a lot harder than the 40s. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, yeah. 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 This isn't half bad looking. Um, quite working. I. It doesn't look like a fun car to me. It's too large. But uh, the design for this car body quite works. It does. Mm -hmm. So I like the, the rear, kind yeah. of, To me, the question now is: Is this a five despite its stats, or is it a, uh, a five with the stats? Huh. Um. Think like the more I look at it, it could be a five due with. to the stats. Mm -mm. Because looking at how large, how so long. So you would the car say it's a good design. Is. Yeah, because looking at how long the car actually is, it's just four point three meters. Oh no! Meters. OCD triggered. The front handles aren't aligned with the line as the rears are. <coughs> <laughs> it's aligned with the body line. No, it isn't. The front isn't aligned. And now, <coughs> there's oh, a little bit. It's yeah. a few millimeters. Yeah. Yes, yeah. please. OCD triggered. Um, Not looking, German, looking, looking at the length, it could be an Audi Sportsback, which is also mm -hmm, 4.3 yeah. meters, so it's fine. Yeah. It just appears long. Oh, but that would be a family sport car, not a fun car. An A3 would be a sports car. Yeah. Or a fun car with a big engine. Hmm. A anyway, so, final verdict. Uh, five with the, the stats. Five. Okay. Chipsgate. All right, this one is aiming a little low with good stats for it being cheap. Very low engineering time, a very, very modest engine, but error appropriate for a smaller fun car. Uh, yeah, definitely spot on for, for a hatch if it is. So let's take a look at the design. Ah, one turbo. Oh. turbo. <laughs> Ooh, a flipped turbo. Like. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, ob ob I like it. Odrut. I like it so, so that in the much. rear mirror you see oh, yeah. turbo. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Like the BMW oh, so. 2002. Turbo. Yeah, I, I, I like it. It's a cool design. Nice. Turbo. Yeah, nice. I, I think this works. This works in an odd way. I don't quite like the front as much as the, uh, as the, the rear. other parts of the design. The rear just just fits. works perfectly. Yes. Yeah. The only issue I have with this car. Mm -hmm. Is the heavy inspiration of the city Honda, turbo? Yeah, Honda city turbo. Yeah. Also, it looks much. It looks mu uh, even though this one is placed early nineties. This looks much more eighties than nineties. True. Yeah, could be. A, yeah, I mean, probably in the ninety one, some squarish city car was still available on the market. Yeah. So. yeah but this but one won't be out until like mid nineties. So. Hmm. True. Yes. Um, so, what do you think of all? Harsh. It's a harsh decision because I'm quite close to give it a seven with the stats. Maybe a st no stretching to eight. It's, it's too much. But yeah. To, to me, it's hard to say. I would give it a five of two reasons. First yeah. of all, it does look quite dated in '91. It could fit in '85. Yeah. And it's way too much in inspired from the City Turbo. Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, I, I would give it a 5 plus 1 for the stats. Maybe so we can arrange a 6 overall. Yes, a 6 overall. Conan Murder! This one is also aiming a little bit high. Not quite backing it up with the stats though. Uh, a somewhat too powerful engine for just being a fun car. It's more of a sports car. And let's take a look. Oh, this definitely looks 90s to me. It is. <laughs> I like it. Oh yeah, God, I yeah. do like it. It has some proper fun car things. A fun mm -hmm. sedan. Yeah. Does oh, the rear work terrible. to yours, well? I think it does. Uh, it works. Yeah. yeah. It's not not as good as the front, I think. No, but exactly. 
the sides. Nice. Overall, this is at mm, least solid. Borilla. Um, if not more, because of the detailing, which is quite nice. Yeah, I would say it's a six, a week it's, six it's overall with the stats. Mm -mm. If the stats were better, probably. Yeah, mm. I can agree with a six. Okay. Next up, Cool K. Aimed squarely at the fun demographic, doing a decent job at it. Not exceptional, maybe. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, that's that's a lot of power for just 1,000 kilos. That's <laughs> that's quite the thing. Um, anyway, let's take a look at the design. It is a small car. Ooh, yes. It's angry. It is angry. Um. Hmm. um uh, I'm not so mm. sure. Uh, I don't quite like the front. The rear is interesting, but looks too large with the fixtures compared to mm -mm. the car size. Mm -hmm. What do oh you guys God, think? The rear, the rear. no. Uh, I, I think the overall like design is a bit meh. It is, it is. Yeah, I was going to give it more around like it's, five, but yeah. It's a little trying too hard with the wheels being all red and stuff. Yeah. Okay. I agree on a four. I agree on a four too. CXN2615. And another one who has figured out how to build fun cars. Uh, 152. Very nice. And aimed a little low. That's fine. It's fine, it's still plainly within target. Um, very nicely done. Adequate engine, very good engineering time. Let's take a look. Ah, oh, the front. Mm. Um, mm. The front isn't quite working for me. Like, no, tiny, the headlights me. are just so tiny. I like the yeah, arrangement with the blinkers, true. but the headlights are yeah. tiny. The idea is great, isn't it? The headlights should be bigger. I also like the, the front decal. I don't know why, but it fits, yeah, it fits, but... It fits in. Definitely fits in. It does. I don't like the mm. colors of it, but that is something you can't change, so I'm not really... <laughs> it it clashes a bit with the, with the yellow. <laughs> the, did you see the arrow on the driver's side? On the... Oh, rescue! Rescue. <laughs> <laughs> on it's the driver's touch. side? Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. I was looking at the New Zealand driver's side, I was like, what, what are yeah, these guys oh, talking true. about? <laughs> you have to look at correct hand drive. Yes, yep. correct hand drive. Uh, anyway, uh, what do you think overall? Uh, probably mm, a five with the stats. A five. I fully agree. I would be meh plus one. Dead Punch Toy 4. All right, a decent scorer. 111 in fun. Uh, these, yeah, decent stats. Not too long engineering time. Good engine for slightly bigger fun car. Yep. Um, design. Hmm. Ah. Okay. It screams like a clash between a Subaru Impreza and a Lancer. It's not bad. Like it. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. Oh, the rear also. It's the, the rear doesn't work with me a bit, but. I, like no. why, I can no. see where he went. No. Uh, I, I quite like the rear. Um, mm. the, the arrangement of the taillights I really like with the, the grill baked into them, basically. And the text mm -hmm. above. To me it works. Um, yeah. The decal... The, the, this, is, this is one thing here I want to point out. The decal here like, it has the same colors that usually bite, but if you put it on a white car, it naturally can't bite. So, yes. Mm -mm. Well, that works. Um, overall, I think this might be a good design. I agree on a good design. Yeah. It's on the, if the stats would be a tad better... Yeah, the stats... I could, yeah, I could easily stretch it to a 7. But not, but not with now, these stats. It's, just it's a average. good... It's a, it's a good 6 for sure. Very close to a 7. Yes. DMUM. Yeah. Uh, some okayish stats, not fabulous, definitely not. 123 horsepower, uh, good engineering time, nothing spectacular here at all. Okay, 
So, design. Hmm. Uh, uh, what is original? It is original. It is for sure. Yeah, it is original. 1999, um, so you can expect something more modern. Yeah. It's the front doesn't work to me. What's yeah, the problem is the front because the rear can be the rear is cool. acceptable. It's, it's yeah. nice. Yes. And the rear the looks like is... proper 90s, definitely. And mm -hmm. the front looks like a concept. Yeah. Yeah. The arrangement overall is pretty good, but mm, doesn't quite work for me. Doesn't gel. Um, anyway, I, I would mm. still think it's it's a five overall because it's definitely I'm unique. Yeah, going for a four, but. Okay, so uh, Felix, what are you saying? Um, I would say the rear holds it up to a five. It's a solid design All right, right there. Then it's a five. Drifter 1996. It is an all right fun car. Nothing special going on here. Good engineering time. Uh, for a little bit over a thousand kilos. Yeah, about right power as well. Okay, design. Um. Ooh, ooh, it looks very bland. Yeah. It does look bland. It it doesn't feel fun. It just feels like it's no. your regular mm. MPV thing mm. you hatch. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Yes. It's like something boring. you could see out on the road, but you wouldn't look twice at it. Uh, yeah. Yep. Okay, it's a four so of it all. Yeah. It's a four. Yes. Agreed. Duke Fireframe. The stats are a little bit on the low side, aimed correctly though. And 120 horsepower, about um, about what you'd expect. Maybe a little bit on the low side. Oh no, it's probably aimed such that it's one horsepower per um, 10 kilos. But anyway, now this is alright but not better. And design? It's very yellow. Yeah. Oh um... my god, the yellow! It's simple, I would say. It's no, simple, but not bad. Yeah. I like the rear. And the yeah, combination the of lower the rear is nicely crafted. That fits. Mm -hmm. That fits very well. Tail lights are a little bit sad. Mm, oh, yes. Probably could twist yeah. both of them a bit to make it a little more... Go from sad to more aggressive. Yeah. Yeah. But it, it, it could be, it could be the, like... Aggressive is when you yeah see tilt them the, the other way. In your, but in your, yes. When you sit in your mirror, you sit angry, and then it passes you, and you will be all oh poor little <laughs> car. <laughs> no one wants yeah. to play with it. <laughs> yes. Okay. That that is. But that's the design, a sad story, it, it man. could it could fit into the nineties. I mean, they had yeah. some quirky designs, uh, so it could yeah. fit. Is it a good design though? Yeah, I'm stopping on a five. Yeah. Yes. And with the stats, I think a five. It's a it's, it's a, a weak six for me in design, and the stats are below average. So, yeah, mm -hmm. fine. I agree. Dylan San. Ah, oh, those stats aren't half bad. It's more like a city car and fun budget car, but still a 106 in fun. Very low power, but if you have a tiny car, you don't quite need that much. Uh, just 865 kilograms. Cool. Um, yeah, that works with the stats and the design oh okay and Ooh. that's like a modernized Ooh. um modernized little hot hatch lovely yes i'm thinking of something that could be from japan it's yeah the engine wise it's a key car oh like yeah the... that's true yes yeah yeah it is a 660 oh, like cc the color combination also it's good yeah, yeah i like the colors it's not so in your face like some of the other designs i also mm. like the the blue accent thingy yeah yep. it's so yep. 90s it is i like not it. not overdone either it's just there yeah no. yeah oh wow. okay so good oh. stats this is a i i'm at I'm, least a I six like it. Ah. Um, in six or seven. Would would it be a stretch to say I would give it a seven? I yeah, it really like a stretch. The it's design says. Mm. 
The, what do you think about the lower rear? Mm -hmm. I think that's something I'm um, undecided about. I, I think that quite adds to it overall, but um, I don't find that design in the front anywhere. Uh, on on the rear, the uh, number plate has this weird bug again. So um, yeah, 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 that's that's fine. You just move it a bit around it. So. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, oh, that's fine. I uh, I'm envisioning a number plate there. Mm -hmm. um, the okay. rear is quite simple, but it works. So is yeah. this a seven? Maybe n would be a stretch, but uh, mm. Ugh, so uh, difficult. Would be, this damn is it. Right. <laughs> would, be a, would be a very, very good six Indeed. or a somewhat solid seven. Could me. we right. try to give the benefit of the doubt and yes. give it a seven and maybe an if we have a, it, this card as a finalist, then we can yeah, decide exactly. more carefully. Yeah, okay, agreed. Because this is this is hard. It scores so well this in the budget hard. demographics. So anyway, so seven. Give it a chance. Seven. Gamer Cheater. Okay, well, this car is aiming high in a pretty good way stats-wise. But then look at the engine. <laughs> How many what? Hot, how many hot hatches can you power with this? About five. Uh, yes. <laughs> mm. No, it tries to it tries uh. to to match the Golf W12. Mm. Yes. So that that is missing the mark a little bit, but the stats are I mean, the stats are there. So okay, let's take a look at the design. Let's look at the fun hypercar. Uh, that doesn't look like a hyper. Oh. Yeah, but very I mean, funny. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, I cannot think to look at this car and having a laugh like, oh, fun, oh, nice, cute. No, it isn't. Not that it's bad looking, but it's too much serious. Maybe it's 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 too bad looking in a fun way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I I just think of all the design is very meh. Yeah, it is. It is. <laughs> yes. Uh. The stats. I mean, the engine is so ridiculous. No. On premium. Uh, I don't think the stats help no. it. I don't think the stats no. help. No. It. So a four. 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 Yep. Yes. High octane love. This car doesn't score very well. Highest and fun premium at 88. Uh, Decent-ish stats and drivability and sportiness. No comfort. 150 horsepower. Is adequate. Um, okay. Let's take a look. Hmm. 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 Uh, first impression isn't all that great. The to me. front ah. does not quite work. It's uh, It more looks like a uh, a car for a cup, uh, like oh, a right. racetrack, uh, yeah, a championship with all the same cars, you know. Mm. It does a bit. The rear is quite cool. Uh, it's an interesting idea. Yeah. The rear gives a whole different vibe to it. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. I think okay, the front so it's not the, and the that rear bad. looks the rear looks like a fun car, like uh, yep. it's a sporty hatch. But yeah. The front doesn't quite. Anyway, what do the you say overall? A, the rear is a spicy hatch. The front is cup. Is mm, yeah. Mm. Okay. Overall, this is hard. Uh, I would say a, sol a solid design. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's unique enough for, for me to give a 5 to, yes. Okay. Hunter 303. Okay, yeah, we have a good fun car. Right, 140 score there. That's pretty good. Let's take a look. Yeah, yeah, this is uh, scoring very well in all of the fun categories. All right. Um, Decent-ish engine, maybe a little bit on the powerful side, especially for sub-1,000 kilograms. But, design. Uh, Carmageddon is the first thing I think about. <laughs> Do, the you front have the looks spikes very... too, right? Oh, the blades. Yes, it is. It is Carmageddon. Yes. yes. Okay. A little more care oh. should have been taken there. Um, the front to me looks like yes. a serious businessman who wants to sell you something now. <laughs> yes, and the vampire teeth are already extended. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let's disregard the the Carmageddon stuff here, um, but. This looks very early 90s to me. Yeah, and yeah, very uninspiring. Yes, uninspiring. That's yes, that's true. true. 
The tires are a little ridiculous, 490s. Yeah. It's not as out. bad as the other one. It's just 220s. <laughs> just 220s, yes. <laughs> not oh, yeah. two 65s. On a tiny car, yes. Uh, the mm. rear works a bit better. Better to me, even though it's very simple. Um, yeah, it's like but, trying yeah. to be a, a sports car there, though. And not really. Nah, not okay. No, it's, it's still yeah. meh. So, yeah. meh? Yeah, a four. Okay. Four yeah, plus four. one? Or no, is four worse? with the stats. So, mm. three plus one. Okay. Yeah. Indie bin. Oh, all right. That's more, that's more a track car than a fun car. It will definitely grind your spine with zero comfort. All right, engineering time. A little too powerful for... No, I stand corrected. A lot too powerful for its weight, especially um, for this category. Anyway, let's take a look at the design. Oh, yeah, ah. those, mm. those tires sticking out at the front. Mm. Um, it's very simple, very uninspired. Mm. Yeah. No, this this is no more than a three in design, I would say. Yeah. Mm, yeah, it doesn't doesn't ring about. Maybe it makes it into a four. What do you guys think? I am. Yeah. I don't like it very much. No, me neither. I don't too. It's. Uh, I think it could be maybe. A three. A three. Starts included. It doesn't okay. even make me just. Mm. Isaac 1709. Oh my. Okay. Well, that is a different category for sure. 280 horse. Uh, track is the best scoring demographic. It's way, way too sporty. This one would be scary to drive. And. Hmm. It still scores pretty well in fun. Above 100, but. Is yeah, this is a sports car. And the design? Um. Uh, okay. Um, there it's are a couple of low. It's extremely low, first of all. Yes, it is. And that is excessive use of chrome for B90s. Absolutely. Too much chrome. Yeah, too, too much the chrome. On the side. Too I don't like the vents on the hood. It's uh, a little too much. It, it, it looks like a truck car. car. Yes. Yeah. It could fit on the truck. True. 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 Okay. Um, so overall, what do you think? It's a mm. bit meh. Poor design-wise. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Jagstang ninety-four. This one is aiming a little high. Fun premium rather than fun. Uh, very long engineering time. It's nine years or over nine years even. Uh, engine is all right. Okay. So, what do you think? Uh, it's brutal. Oh, yes. another come get on for me. But um, yes, yeah, so this this time it's that. knives. It's yeah. just knives, not spikes. Yes. The rear looks oddly empty. Mm -mm. Um, yep. Although, okay, I no, no, I'm not so convinced about the design overall. But the squarish, kind of still a little bit squarish look, is a nice transition from the 80s, with some rounder elements like rounded edges instead. But the rear looks yeah. more modern than the front, doesn't it? It's a weird thing. I wouldn't connect the front to the rear at all. Mm. And also the handle on the side, uh, you cannot <laughs> it open both the doors. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Oh, oh, that that is pretty. That's pretty you, bad. You open both doors at the same time. Also the. No. Oh no! Wait a second. That. Do you think that's deliberate? Oh yeah, it looks deliberate. Uh, it's. Yeah, deliberate on the, on the rear, on the, on the vertical. Oh, the yes. vertical rear is deliberate, but the, the front yes. one is just off. I mean, <laughs> it's, yes. it's not yes. good. And then the blinker doesn't fit on that line either. And it's, mm, no. mm, not That's necessary, good. but okay. yeah, it's... Uh, mm. is it, I don't is it, think I can give it 
And more than a four, four is a stretch. Yeah, yeah. four. It's a four. James 2K. A pretty reasonable fun car, nothing spectacular here. Everything is about in line with what I would expect. Okay. Design. Okay. That's... Uh, the, the paint is interesting. I like it. The paint is good. Yes. I like the color. It's a good pearlescent effect. Does it have pearlescent? But... Yeah. It has oh, black. Oh, yeah, yeah. Of course. Yeah. It's black a red and black. black re yeah, yeah, yeah. That's nice. Dark red and black. It looks good. Yeah, like it looks it. good. The front looks a bit... The car says 1999. It should release like 2002 of the engineering. It does not look like that at all. It looks really odd from the. If you look the front from a bit from the side, it looks really odd. Oh, yeah. oh my! Yeah, with the, lights the headlights don't. Out, yeah. the, the headlights also don't fit. It's too yeah, much old. late uh, yeah. late 80s, early 90s. Okay, overall, what do you think? Uh, probably another four. Another four. Yeah, I would tend towards uh, a five. Five. Although the rear works. Yeah. So yeah, exactly. okay, the rear five. works, paint works, at five. John Dam Madden. Oh, yeah, that looks like an appropriate fun car. Uh, it's scoring all right. Decent engine, low engineering time. What about the design? Uh, the front could work, but the whole front is a bit too low. Yeah. Yeah. It gets this vast area towards the top, almost like half the area, which is just completely empty, yes. And the rear is like... The rear is interesting, but all it's here, like here it's, the op it's the opposite here. The <laughs> bottom is very empty. The um, yeah. misaligned stripes on the side. Like not being able to open the door, or just be almost, almost placed correctly, the seam. It's placed uh, correctly in the front. The, yeah. It's the, um, I can ex explain that design. It's like if you open the door, it breaks the plastic bars, and you have to buy them new. Oh, mm. that's an excellent money machine. Yes, yes. Uh, you're, exactly. You're right. um, the EFI logo on the side does work very well there for me. And it does. the rear. What do you think about the rear? Uh, the real taillights, it's coming out from, yes, the 80s, late 80s, but mm -hmm. doesn't fit for 1999. Okay, overall? A four. A four. Hmm. Well, plus one for the yeah. stats. Although, no, yeah, I, I would stats. tend towards a, a lower five and the stats solidify the five. Okay, five. Chemicali Ali. Well... This is a little bit of a conundrum. Uh, zero scoring, but scoring reasonable in the stats. So, um, figure it out. Well, that that is the fuel. What the hell are you doing? Why are you running it on regular leaded? It isn't available in the 90s. Right, I switched over to 95 just to see how it scores. It's, it's not doing that well. 80 in fun premium. And what do we think about the design? Looking at the front, I would say, Hi, Skyline! How are you? Hi, Skyline, yeah. On the yeah. rear, I would say, Hi, Skyline, fake! How are you? <laughs> uh... Alright. Um, what do you think of all? Um, Is four, it four, probably. F four, four minus, four, no, four minus uh, one? Four minus one. Yeah. Kieran Harrison. All right, yes, that is a proper scoring fun car right there. It's doing well. Um, it's doing well in all the fun categories. Uh, family sport and sport budget even. So that's that's really good. I like it. And what about the design? <laughs> it's not okay. comfortable. I, I think it says Ooh. sport. But it can't uh, read let me, it. Let me put on my small. glasses. It's I can't see it. It's so small text. It's um, a bit between the lines. Yes. Subtle. Yeah. <laughs> the rear. Oh my. Oh wow. God, that's busy. Yeah, but it's a little I, busy. Some way I like. Yeah, you know, I like exactly. Yeah. One uh, of the problems. It problem, might, for might example, be a bit I, too modern. The rear. It has this Nine weird clash. It's, it has modern elements and it has old elements, then it has correct oh. elements. Okay. In 98, 
came out the first Ford Focus, and oh, okay. I think the car was already out, so the new edge design was in full roll. Okay, and fair enough. Overall, I, I quite that, like this design. Yes, but there is yeah. one thing that it really makes me angry. It's the use of white fixtures on plastic bumpers. Why? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, Why? Yeah. Put it all plastic or make it a white uh, bumper. But why do you have to ruin a good design? Because it was a good design with stupid colors arrangement. Hmm. All right. So what do you think of all? I would still say it's a good design despite these things. It is, yes. And yes. plus one for the design. stats because plus those are really yes. nice. It's a seven. Seven. I agree with you. Seven. Maybe with different color arrangement could be also scratch yeah. the eight. But... Yes. Yes. Agreed. Next up, close off. Okay. Here we have a decent fun car. Uh, 118 and fun. Nicely targeted. Below 1,000 kilograms. 125 horsepower. That's good. Design. Oh, it looks a little sad. Yeah. It's a sad yeah, car. It's not the fun is all sad. It's like mm, it doesn't look like much fun. Like, yeah. isn't, isn't this like the antithesis of fun? This look. <laughs> and also the other side of the nineties. And it's not end of the nineties. This is start of the nineties. Oh yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, here we have another vertical design for. What is going on with these people placing, placing the handle? Handles on the door handles on the seams. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm starting to think maybe there is a morph morph but issue. How? Oh, maybe. I don't think you can. Oh it yeah, could, can, it yeah. could be. It could be the. It could be a morph yeah. issue. Yes. It could be the could B be pillar not issues. saving. Yeah. So if, mm. because if you pull the B pillar back, interesting the thing. It, it, it looks okay. Okay. Makes sense. Yeah, that that might be the case. Anyway, so overall, what do you say? Yeah, it could be a um, um, solid five, probably. A solid five. Oh, really? Okay. I was tending more towards... Uh, stats, oh, okay, the, with uh, the, the stats, stats, yeah. Okay, yeah, with the stats, it's a five. Okay. Nitrophonics. A decent scorer. 108 in fun. Nicely targeted. 130 horsepower. Yeah, at 800 kilos, that's definitely more than enough. Let's take a look. Ooh. That's okay. interesting. Yeah. Mm. Uh, the little yeah. vent up there, it's its its kind of interesting and disturbing at the same time. The one on the bonnet? Yeah. Oh, it's, yeah it's fine. I am... That could fit. I mean, it makes sense to have it there. It's... I'm sorry that the front is good. I mean, there's good arrangement, enough fixtures, it work. Yeah. The rear uh, doesn't stand the front. It, Something is missing. Mm, oh yeah, no, I agree. Yeah, I agree. The rear okay. tries to have something. Overall it. score. It's empty. Uh, a good six. Yeah, I would agree. Six, it's probably yeah. six. Next up, a lot of fan. Oh, well, this one is missing the mark a little bit. Fun premium, just barely, barely decent in that, and oh, kind of. Meh stats. 286 horsepower, that's plenty. But it's also a reasonably heavy car. And uh, still too powerful. Uh, anyway, design? Um, uh, um. Uh, I I get what he tries to make. I get it. Alada? But I don't know. It's, it tries <laughs> to be a sleeper ish, simple design. Yeah. But it doesn't work. No, yeah. it doesn't. Look at the rear tires from behind. Is that adequate? Wow. No, no, it isn't. No, it isn't. No, and the front it's tires neither. Design. Yeah, no, this isn't good. It's quite poor, and the design does, the stuff doesn't help very much. No, exactly. Yes. So poor. It's a free. Poor. It's a free. Yeah. Next up is Lucas. Uh, it's a track car. It is a track car. And, yeah, fun, it's just 84. Uh, engineering time is okay. 320 horsepower, way too much. Design? No. Let's take a look. 
1999, body too square. Yeah. Weird headlight. Like, off. Weird no. fixtures. Doesn't work. No. I think no. it's a three. It's, it's a free. Okay, I agree. Machalel. It is a decent scoring car. Hits the mark. Um, a little powerful, maybe, towards the edge, but we have seen far worse. Uh, this is alright. And design. Oh, okay. Oh, that could work. Okay. Yeah, no, I quite yeah. like it so far. Do I like it too? The strength on the front. I really like the rear. It's nice. Yeah, it is. Oh, this is good. I could give it a six with no issues. Mm. Um, are the, the, no. My question really is: Are the stats enough for a seven or not? Because I, no. I like the, des no. the design no. overall seems really nice to me, but the stats aren't aren't good enough, right? No, 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 no. no. The normal, the a six. Not good enough. Martin PL sixty six. Um, a little low stats overall. Just it's well targeted, but low. Um, 133 horsepower. All right, engineering time. Design. Oh. Hmm. Okay. No, that's not not oh. bad. I really okay. like the uh, how the uh, lights flow with the vents up front. Oh yeah. It's nicely mm -hmm. crafted. Yeah. The front is. Uh, quite original, but the rear really looks like a ripoff of the Mazda Demio. Yes, it is a Mazda Demio from the rear. <laughs> <laughs> the, the lights yeah. are Mazda Demio lights. Yeah. Just the lights? Well, a little bit of arrangement and everything, but yeah, the lights really screams to me. Hey, I'm a Mazda Demio. So, okay, okay, okay. Don't worry. Just, just <laughs> Don't worry. So loud. Yes. Yeah. Settle down, son. Okay. Child. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you might be a Demio. Uh, okay. Don't worry. Yes. Um, I, so overall, I, it's a very solid six. If the sets will be better, probably a yep. seven. Yeah, I well, agree. Yes, highly. with above one hundred stats, this would be a seven to me. Like this, mm -hmm. it's like half half a point off, and that kills it. There, it's a six. Next up, Micon P7. Another car with pretty low stats. Ah, uh, just eighty-three in fun. Mm, it's pretty weak. Uh, reasonable engine, reasonable engineering time. Let's take a look at the design. Brown. Brown. It's a brown car. Yeah, the brown doesn't really screams to me. I'm a fun little car that you can drive <laughs> and have fun on it. Oh, no. I'm a doesn't fun really little help. turd. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> I'm a fun little bubble because that's what Blas means. Ah, um, yes, yes. A little yes. bubble. No, it doesn't look too it's bad cute. to me. It yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. it's a cute car. It has car, some yes. really nice elements. The doing on the roof is like a neat element. What I two what the, I like two over the top. is this rear lower uh, tail light with the gold in the middle. That quite works as an accent overall on the rear. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. Yeah. Um, I, I think it's an all right design. It's a five. Yeah, yeah it is. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. a five. MJ Decker. Uh, another one that just scores 84. Ah, that's that's a little low. 150 horsepower. It's all right, and good engineering time. And the design. Ah, the front doesn't work for me. The rear work very nice. The rear yes. is awesome. It's the, like the fart nice. can. <laughs> it's awesome. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the exhaust too, and it's perfect. It's it proper. Is. Yeah, it yeah, just yeah. fits yeah. perfectly. It is perfect, yes. Yes, okay. <laughs> the side but, is correct. Uh, the front yeah. light is. Mm, yeah. Yes, the front the is a yes. letdown compared to the rest of the car. The mm. front is more in line with the stats of the car. Uh, so, overall, a five because of the awesome rear? Overall, yes. A five would be it. Thanks to the back. And then there was Mort 13. Good stats of all, more towards the fun budget category it seems, which is absolutely fine, aiming a little low. Very lightweight, below 100 horsepower, very, very good choice there. And very low engineering time. Okay, nice. Okay, design, whoa! What, what the hell the is this? 
Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. No. That, that no. is a no. complete concept weirdo car. But it's not bad, I have to say. <laughs> no, it's not bad. Uh, it's not bad. It's not something you would see on the road. Ever. Yes. Yes. No one would... You would not be seen. In but on an, uh, at an auto show, definitely, this one would stick out. Yes. 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 Hmm. Yes. So wh how do we handle this one? It has really nice stats. It has a unique design that works in its own weird way. But it's not appropriate. So is it a minus one for inappropriate? And then we just judge design and technicality? Oh. Yeah. Okay, so I think is it a very good minus one because of that? Yes, it is very good. I mean, it is very well crafted. So a very good could be yeah uh, on only the design, but it is not the car we're looking for. Yes. So it's go to six, and the stats will hold. I think oh, yeah. a six. Yeah, this yeah, car definitely. is a six. Will hold a six. Cool. Mister Chips, a pretty decent, fun premium car. It looks like. Even has some comfort. Uh, quite heavy. It also has more power. More like sports car, this one. Yeah, it's not quite a fun car. Um, but anyway, let's take a look at the design. Oh, we have some morph issues here again. Yeah. Like yeah. the tire sticking out. Yeah. Can't really fault the car for that. We've had, we've seen that several times now that the mm -hmm. tires are sticking out, which points towards that the morphs didn't save properly. So, um, not going to penalize it too much for that, but we can only judge what we are seeing, unfortunately. So, apart from the blades sticking out at the front, of course. You just disregard yeah. them. Anyway, it just wants to knife you. The front is really I, nice. Uh, yes, it is. There's something Subaru-esque. Mm -hmm. Subaru Mazda-esque, actually. I mm -hmm. like the, the sides cross. as well. Yeah. Nice, consistent. And I like the rear, too. Yes, the, the rear, rear is good. nice. But, but it feels like a mix between a Mercedes and a BMW, very mm. extremely. Mm. Mm, okay, yeah, I can see that. Um, overall, nicely crafted, though. It is nice. Yeah. It misses the it's... category a bit, and the stats yeah. aren't high at all. That's why I can give it a 7. I can give it a good, good 6. It's a good 6. Yeah. Okay, I agree. It's a, like a high 6. <laughs> okay. Then we have Max Miller 98. Oh, okay. A decently scoring fun car. Very, very powerful. It's way too powerful for a lightweight body like this. Uh, for the fun category, that is. But anyway, other things are looking decent. So, design? Hmm. Oh, a little concept mm -hmm. car ish. The real beast too weird. Sad. Mm. It's very sad. Yeah. Oh, oh my it's god, cross. it's so sad. <laughs> oh no. Ah, uh, depression. Okay, uh, overall. It's it's meh. A meh design. Mm, yes. Alright, I agree. NDK Nico. Oh, a fun budget car. One that many people, even in the fun budget, in the budget category, can afford. Oh, that's that's quite something. This is really on the cheap side. Very nicely scoring in the fun category itself as well. Good stat distribution apart from the spine grinding that is going on with the comfort. And okay, yep, uh, adequate power. Let's take a look. The side is weird. The front is weird as a well. shape. It's the, top grill is, the top grill is either too high or the headlights are too low. Mm. Yeah. I can't mm. decide. Yeah. It's a weird car. Everywhere. Everywhere. I agree. The, the rear is the, the, the most normal to me. <laughs> but it's, uh, yes. Yeah. It has a weird shape too. From the side. Just yes. the profile. Yeah. See, super see, weird. It's a weird. It's a weird car all over the place. Well, it's definitely a car that would stand out. So... It's in a slightly positive way too. Weird, but um, I would. Hmm. Is it a five plus one? The stats would say so. It's yes. It's, it's a good car. Yeah, it is. Okay. Next up, 
Nick. I am a very drivable, decent, fun car. Um, not not great. Good power. All right engineering. What about the design, though? Okay, it's early uh, it's, 90s. Okay, it's so. early 90s, but, but it almost save it. too square. Yeah. 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 Look at 80s. what came out in the early 90s, like the Golf 3 and, and such. It's way too mm. cornery. It's too edgy. This is a poor. This is a tree. Yes. Mm. Mm -hmm. Stats included, I think, is not more than a tree. No, no. Yeah, like the rear doesn't have that much care put into it with the lights arrangement either and stuff. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I can see that. All right, a three. Power trip six six six. Okay. Yeah, decent fun car. Um, not spectacular in any way. But let's take a look at the design. Is that spectacular? No. Spectacular, no. no. Definitely not, no. It's alright. Maybe solid. Yeah. It's solid. To me, the uh, screen's you know, alright. Like... <laughs> what do you not like? Yeah. Uh, the handles. It. I think the key should be on the other side of the handle. It looks hmm. strange. Alright. Uh... They are on the other side on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> also, yeah, they're wrong, but okay. <sighs> okay, so um, uh, is it a meh or is it a five? I think I it's can five. Give it I can give it five. a five. Yes. Proud cipher. Oh yeah, a car aimed at more like the family sports segment, but still doing well in the fun categories. Both fun premium and fun. Almost the same score there. Pretty well done. A little overly powerful, I would say. Um, engineering time is fine, though. Okay, design. Okay. Design, it's. It's yeah. not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. I agree. Bad isn't. That doesn't win you any prizes, though. Not bad. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, is it an alright design? It's alright. It works. Yeah, yeah. It's not. Excellent or good, but it, it's all yeah. right. Is it simple? Yeah. Is it five. solid enough five to make it a six with the stats or not? Hmm. Are the stats good enough? No, no, no. Okay, it's a five. Punto Fire. It's a good fun car. Nothing spectacular though. Two hundred eight horsepower. <laughs> Maybe a little over the top, but all right. Let's take a look at the car. Oh, I get instant 90s vibes from this one. Yes. I do too. It is really 90s. There are some details well crafted. I like yeah. I like it. Oh, the, the rear with the um, number plate holder is pretty cool. Yes. Oh, it is. Yeah. Also, oh, this automation is a... keyhole for yeah. your automation keys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's really hmm. good. Um... I have to say, this is a good design. It's simple but it good. <sighs> it, it manages to do simple but good. But is the is the good uh, without all of the stats? Because the stats are quite good. Yeah, I well, can no, give they, it a they, six. They, like, the stats it's are not a six. seven. The, si the stats them themselves are a six, basically. So yeah. Yeah. Okay. it holds tight at the six. Next up, Rassel. Uh, all right. Well, that is some bullshit stats right there. What? Oh, okay. Material cost 125,000. This is probably a full carbon fiber thing. Uh, chassis carbon fiber, carbon fiber panels. Well, yeah, you won't be selling any fun hot hatches soon, son. That's, that's, and still almost a thousand kilos. What the heck are you doing? All right. Now this is, this is a straight up minus one. Um, and the car? The design? The, the front looks either uh, mega upset or... It is. <laughs> no, it's just a moustache. It's just a moustache. <laughs> oh! It's, uh, it's upset for the engineering time. Yeah. Yes. Good. And the rear is upset too, that it didn't... didn't The budget ran out, so they didn't have any more fixtures there. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hmm. No, no. Two. So, it's a two. It's is a it two. two because it misses so much? Yeah. I, w yeah. I would say Full the design is... Yes. Yeah. Okay. 
Rudolf Hocker. Poor scores all round. This one isn't doing well. 150 horse. Very low engineering time. Okay, it's adequate, but um, no. Low stats. Design? Well, it's a low car. Ah. <laughs> Looks low. Um, but hmm. it's very low. It doesn't look half bad, though. It doesn't look that bad, yeah. I agree. Yeah. And the sides are okay-ish. I really don't like the color of the rims. It's so mm, okay. it's out of place. Um, the rear is all right as well. Take some design elements from the front with the lower part there. Somewhat at least. Mm, so overall, a, a four uh, with the stats. It's yeah. sort of overall. Yes. Maybe a, but yeah, minus Three, one, minus one, four. I four. would go with a four overall with stats. Sinawi. That's proper good stats here. Wow, that drivability is through the roof for a mid 90s car. Very nicely done. Uh, good engineering time, too. Good amount of power. Low weight. Nice. Okay, that's a definite plus one. And the design? Yeah, really stand the no. stats. No. No. Ah. Boring. The stats, the stats promised more. Well, definitely yeah. any driver that sees it and then tests drive it will be positively surprised. Um, sure. But no, the design is not more than a meh, if not a poor design. I don't know. Yeah, the stats design, helps a bit. So design I will give is it a, a four. Meh. Yeah. Overall a four. So overall a four. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sing Star Mix Master. Oh my, very low stats. Very low stats as well, and 86 in fun, hmm, would be low average for sure, uh, otherwise, otherwise very reasonable. Let's take a look at the design. Hello there, 80s uh, car. Kilrob, there's a yes. call for you. It's the 80s. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we found a Neptune Apex. It was dug mm. out of a barn. And yeah, someone uh, lost yeah. it. Someone lost it. Uh, anyway, what do you think? It's. A... I mean, it's a mad design overall. Yeah. It yeah, would I, be the 80s, it would be solid. Even poor. But, uh, but poor with the stats, poor. I think it's a poor design. Yes. Yeah. Next up, CV Tech. Okay ish stats, nothing spectacular. Let's move on to the design. Huh. Original. Yeah. Maybe. It does look nice. The rear is a bit disappointingly narrow, but mm. it looks 90s overall. Not too yeah. bad. Not 1997, maybe more around 1994, 5. Well, mm. okay. True. Good work. Good work, by the way. Yeah. Not big off. Yeah. Not much off. Is it all right? It it's is right. solid, yeah, right. It's okay. a solid five, yes. The killer noob. All right, how the hell do you build a fun car that becomes a light <laughs> delivery vehicle? <laughs> uh, that's that's an achievement, man. <laughs> okay, uh, very lightweight, um, very high power, and very very poor <laughs> stats hey okay, um let's take a look at the design it doesn't look like a light delivery what the hell it's mm. white it's oh that that must be <laughs> the color doesn't. yeah it's white with plastic bumper it uh, looks like a, a delivery van yeah yes <laughs> yeah uh, it has a two plus three seat arrangement that's that's weird but what? anyway what do you think about the design meh Meh. Oh, the rear yeah. doesn't work for me. Ugh. No, me neither. Oh. It looks like it got could, a, could we a, even a, say it's a free? Because uh, for it the got a, like an uppercut to the chin. My god. In the rear. Mm -hmm. Just look at it. Uh, he reversed against a, a steel bar. Oh, yeah. Very high speed. <laughs> exactly. Um, okay, now this is a. This is a free. Free. Yes. Mm -hmm. The Miltos. 
Yep, starting on this screen, just because, wow, that's some pretty good scoring. Everything's green. <laughs> it's very nice. Wow. Wow. That's well done. So, uh, let's take a look. Good, very good stats overall. Adequate power for the weight and um, reasonable engineering time. What about the design? Ooh, cool. Uh, yeah, that works. Wow. Okay. I am I'm happy. I'm really I'm happy. Positively surprised. That looks good. Everything looks like it is supposed to be that way. And well, apart from the wheels. If I want to be yeah, exactly. If I want to be peaking, the wheels are a little bit uh, yeah. thin. Yes, they are. The rear Maybe is all right. The rear is certainly. solid as well. Maybe yeah. good even. Um so overall, what do you say? Is this a is this a seven with the stats? Yeah, it is. could close. It's a good design. The st actually, the stats would warrant it being a seven. Yeah, the yeah. stats weren't probably a low seven, one. but uh, anyway, it's a seven. Yeah, it's a seven. Seven. The Roadrunner Thirty Six. Another good scoring car. One hundred twenty-nine and fun. Nicely done. More like a light sport budget and track car though. Oh yeah, zero comfort, ouch my spine. Uh, 118 horsepower, kind of reasonable for that weight. Let's take a look at the design. Okay, it's 1990. Oh, yeah. God, the, the 80s Please. have dropped again. The uh, thing is, I could stand at the back, 1990, but the front, it's too weird. But my issue is work. the body is too old for the 90s it's if you look what came out in the 90s or 91 yeah, yeah but this uh, could be could... a borderline if you make it a good like a restyling version of a late 80s could work yeah. but could work but you'd have to make to put a lot of effort in it it's not I, easy i think the so... central vents there if those were removed it would look a bit more appropriate and not yes. sure um okay of all, meh, a four. It's a meh. Ah, uh, with those stats, definitely a five to me. Five. Okay. Okay. okay yes. Look, look at the market demographics. Yeah. Look at the front. Yeah. Okay. That's another good <laughs> argument. <laughs> okay, okay, let's Both. go with five. Let's Both go with good five. arguments. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Five. Let's go with a five. Come on. Next up, title guy one. Oh, aiming a little high and doing so with very low stats maybe not very low but yeah no it's this this is below average certainly um, for the weight somewhat good power maybe a little on the high end for fun uh, for fun car okay let's take a look at the design oh, no the front uses those weird headlight thingies it doesn't work. Yeah. Mm, I would like to see the headlights there. Yes. And for 1990s, sorry. It doesn't fit. Yeah. Too late. The sides do look quite modern no. too. The rear is the, the thing that works. Yeah, the oh, rear 1990s. works really good. Oh, this this isn't... No, I, I, I can't give this more than a... Uh, between four and five because the yes, stats are not very five. good. The, yes. the design is solid. Let's give it a five. Yeah, I can give it a five. Alright, yeah. Alright, it's to me it's really hard more tending stretch. towards four, but yeah, okay, it's a stretch five. Tom Hicks. The aim was about right. They uh, follow through with it, not so much. Just 84 in fun. Poor stats of all, spine grinding, mm, adequate power, good engineering time. What do we say about the design? Again. Again, 80s. Okay. Difficult. Difficult to use this body. Yeah, it is. Uh, it is. I like the double was... chrome thing on the front for the bumper. That's pretty cool yeah. as a yeah. design. And the what front doesn't look called? half bad to me. It's just a little time like the, the period of what was the score of fun it is something 
The score in fun is 84? See, that's where the car comes from, 84. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. If you take a look at the back, on the by three quarter looks like the Fiat Panda in some way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so overall, so, four. Um, a four. A four, maybe also a three because the stars are not very good. No, no, I would say it's more like a, a five minus one. It's not error correct, I agree, but it's like a four to okay. me. But if you yeah. say a three, then. No, um, no, okay, no, no, a four. A four. Troller coaster. All right, pretty good stats overall. Aiming a little high there. Fun premium, but it's in the right um, right line. And good stats. Way too much power for, the, for a fun car. <laughs> <laughs> but also rather he uh, heavy. Oh, overall, pretty good. And the design? Screamy oh, yellow. Screaming yellow again. Mm. Well, it seems to be a theme on this cars. Well... I like the rear. The arrangement of the tail lights. Oh, six exhaust pipes, man. But it's a V12, so six. It's a V12. Yeah. <laughs> Free per bank. Well, oh, it's also a V12 turbo. Oh, okay. A 2.5 liter V12 turbo. Yes. Suicide doors. Suicide doors also. <laughs> <laughs> It, it has to be a little trolly with that name, yes. Uh, anyway, what do you think? I mean, the design is a... Uh, I don't know. I it's mean, carefully it's not... trolling. Yeah, it's... But it's careful, tasteful trolling. I can give it a 5, by the way, because can... there are some interesting ideas. Yeah. I can give it a 5 for sure. A 5 of all. Yes. Tsushinoko real. Oh yeah, overall pretty decent stance, doing well, 120 in fun, that's good, and adequate power for the weight and low engineering times. Excellent! What about the design? Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh! Hmm. Consistent front and rear. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But... I like the sides too. It lies on the rear, it says quad cam, but only has an inline 4. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Probably yep, it's like yeah, it four valve uh, for Selena, so it's quad for each can be ah, four. Yeah. Oh and some, yeah. Well, that, that is pulling something out of out of your ass, your marketing ass, yes. Okay. Um what about I could give it a five it's the solid. score. Yeah. No, I think this is better than a five. I think it's better than a that, five. That just yeah, definitely. This is a clear six to me. Look at it from the side. Okay. It's, so, it's so consistent. I agree with you. Yeah. I agree yeah. with you. I agree. Can I give it a six? Tuna Guy 21. Huh. All right. Well, a track car. Very high sportiness. Very, very high sportiness, especially compared to its drivability. Just 140 horsepower. So well done getting that much sportiness out of it with that power. And that should be a good note to all the other competitors in here. You don't need that much power to make a sporty car. Look, it's not even zero comfort, even though it's a track car. And a look at the uh, demographics. It's not doing all that well in fun, so it misses the mark a little bit. But overall, this is a good light sports slash track car. Anyway, though, let's take a look at the design. And that's how it achieves it. Mid-engined. Yes. Ah, mid-engined, yep. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Hmm. Well, it certainly looks hmm. fun. It doesn't score does. that well in that category, not, though. So. Not too mm -hmm. keen on the front. It's The, the taillights are a bit too narrow. Mm, yeah. And it looks a little derpy, yeah. Um, rear works. And the sides... All right, yeah, yeah, I like the massive, massive vent going there. Or continuing the lines, basically, of the car. Yeah, um, yeah overall, I think mm -hmm. this is this is all right. It's a solid yeah, five. Yeah, not more than a five, then. No, not more yeah. than a five, but not it's, more than a five. It's a, it's a solid design. Ticonderoga. Well, that is good. 
That's good scoring. 144 in fun. And it definitely has the stats to back that up. Very high sportiness too. Uh, adequate power for the segment. Maybe even a little bit on the high side. And 1080 kilograms. A little high engineering time there, but not as there's so much that we would have to penalize it. Okay. Design. It looks like a toad. Ooh. It's very yeah, wide mouth. It has the morph oh, issue again. Oh, mine doesn't. That's interesting. Oh, good. Uh, it, it looks um, uh, very wide. How can, how can you use that uh, side view mirrors? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> on on 1995, weird. those mirrors. Mm. Maybe it's off the market. <laughs> <laughs> they are weird. It's but like they, a bicycle. Only, they only stick out a little bit from the morphs he placed, so. It's yeah, but it super looks wide. like Alien's antenna. It does. Of. Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, it does. The rear. Uh, uh, it doesn't uh, remind the front, it's completely not different. at all. Mm -mm. Mm. Okay, overall, what do, you, what do you think? I can give it a, s a five. Four plus one. Yeah, four plus one. Yes. Yes, uh, four plus one. Yes, the design fails a little, but the stats are good. Okay. Viventar. Uh, this one is missing the mark slightly. Uh, overall, somewhat low stats. Fun, 87. Otherwise, it's pretty much spot on with the engineering and power, so let's continue to design. It doesn't look very funny. The front looks like a Nissan. The Almera or Primera. Mm. Yeah, it also put the logo that looks like a Nissan. Mm. Mm. In the rear? I like the rear a bit. There are some interesting things. Yeah. Yeah, it's but... an interesting use of the, uh, the black part there. I don't know what it is. Maybe a stripe, something stretched. Yeah, it's, it's a stripe. It's a stripe. I'm quite sure it's a stripe. Yeah, it is. But it doesn't look like a fun car. It like looks no, like it a isn't. family car. Looks like a boring sedan. Okay, so yes. what do we say? It's quite meh, isn't it? Yeah, it is quite meh. Yeah, four, yes. Vinny Scarletto. Oh yeah, this one hits the mark. Fun, 132, pretty good. Spine grindingly uncomfortable, uh, but adequate power and engineering time. Let's take a look at the design. Uh, it's different to all the other cars that use this body. It looks yes, a bit more yes, modern. Exactly. I was just about to point that out. It's w working better with the body for the early 90s. It's 1990 here, so I can mm -hmm. accept that it's error correct. Um, yeah. And yeah. I mean, the use of the little lines on the rear and stuff, that works. The line going all the way around the car. Pretty cool. Hmm. Uh, I, I think it's at the, least solid, if not a six to me. Yeah. It's, so, it's solid. Five, I'm sure. Yes. Six. Five, yes. Five, I would say a five six plus one. Six would be stretched, but yeah, okay. Five plus one? Mm, not for me. Okay. And Pilix? It's a stretch, but I agree. Okay, six. Next up, Weasel. Oh, definitely a fun car. 117, very high drivability, quite low sportiness, but it's only 75 horsepower. You can get a lot of things done with just 75 horsepower in a small car. Below 1,000 kilos, low engineering times, that's good. Yep, let's take a look at the design. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, it's angry. Oh, oh God, it's an angry. <laughs> it's really angry. <laughs> Well, and the real yeah. is a mess. I think he um, missed the category in the sense that it's it's not supposed to be a joke car. It's supposed to be a fun car. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Wow. It's supposed to be a fun car, not an evil car. Yeah, the rear doesn't work to be so so busy. All the lines no. going Too on. Too many fixtures. Mm. And it doesn't fit the fr uh, the sides whatsoever. Um, uh, so. I I mean, it's a it's a good joke, but it's not more it's than that. It's a fun I mean. car, but not a fun yes. car. Yeah, uh, exactly. Uh, on the rear, I like the idea that he put like one 
uh, reverse light and one fog light, but they are not exactly aligned to each other. One is higher than the other. Yeah. yeah. Are they? Yeah, they are. Yes, the red one is higher. It looks like at least. Yes. Um, okay. Anyway, so what? How do we deal with this one? <laughs> is it a? Is the three plus one or something? Or two plus uh, one? Yeah, three plus one. Three two. plus one could be it. Yes. Okay. We got a good laugh out of it, so. Yeah, mm. true. Next up, Sneaky Sims. A good scoring car across a quite a range of segments. Looking at the demographics, it's a big patch of green. And... Well, spine grinding, that's for sure. But overall, pretty decent. Way too powerful, though. Anyway, design? Uh, doesn't give me the fun vibe. Gives me more the... A serious... Uh, more premium, premium, right? It's a premium. A semi, semi serious sports yeah. car, or even GT-esque thing? Yeah. Nah, not GT. It's, to me, it's more like a uh, like mid-range BMW or something. From the, the vibe it gives. Uh, mm -hmm. Not the design yeah. itself, but the, the the vibes, as if it fits in yeah. the class. Um, anyway, so hmm. in its in of itself, it is a pretty decent design, I would say, but it misses misses the style. Fun, yeah. So is it, it a does. four? It is a four. Yes, it's it is a four. four. It's and a four. the stats are really good, though. Overall, although no, nah, not that good. They're uh, overall good, but not, yeah, not focused focused in the category. Fun. Yeah, not <laughs> that category, folks. That's all right. Okay, five. Yak 38. Oh, the stats. They are not good. <laughs> they are not good at all. Um, not terrible, but not good either. So, one to seven. Yeah, it's appropriate otherwise. Good engineering time. Okay, power. So, design? Ho! Holy <laughs> Wow! <laughs> what? It's oh, uh, so cute! It's, it's interesting. It's a four by four. <laughs> it's a it's an off roader. The the front main grill on top is pretty cool. With the layout and the turbo oh, inlay yes. is really awesome. I like this. Finely crafted. It's aligning it well. Is. Ooh, look at nice the the top looks like a sunroof. Very well made. It also. is a sunroof. Oh, that's. Yeah, that's really good. Wait, the sides, oh, one. they are so, they're a little over the top, but I can see this uh, being a Japanese style car. So, yeah, that kind of works there. And they the put a lot of... What? Fish. The rear! <laughs> spare wheel, so yeah. That's the first time I it's see a cool. spare wheel. Yeah. And the door, this is... is this a door handle? That is the number plate holder? Yes. Yes. That's awesome. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it is awesome. Oh, shit. Okay, oh, to, to me... It's, I like it. To me, this is an 8 minus 1 because of the fucking stats. <laughs> yes. Yes. I, agree. I completely I agree. I fully eight agree. Minus one. Yes. Just sign it off. Schmeez. Oh, my. This isn't a, a car that scores well at all. Below 70 in all categories, and when you look at... Oh, the market stab is awful. Ooh. Uh, uh, way too much power. Inappropriate, so... Uh, but, yeah. Slightly high engineering time, not, not bad. Good weight. Anyway, let's take a look at the design. Uh, oh, yes. Like mm, uh, how about How about no? That doesn't work. Mm. The rear is just slapped on. The front is just slapped on with random parts. Yeah. No, doesn't it doesn't work. work. No, it doesn't work. Two. One. With even. the stats, it's a one. No more than a yeah, one. Yeah, it's a one. 